I would describe Ms. Hines as a very upbeat and super happy teacher because she's always having fun with us and laughing. Ms. Hines is very intelligent and like knows what she's talking about, but also isn't afraid to admit when she makes a mistake. Um, I would describe Ms. Hines as someone who's really energetic and even though she's kind of noisy and likes to mess around, she also is able to be all like, all right, do this work and then we laugh again and it's really cool. Well, I think I'd describe Ms. Hines as someone who can both have fun but also keep the class in order and keep it controlled. Yeah. She's mm -hmm. awesome. <laughs> so you can see, well, you'll be able to see there's two taped lines on the back floor. All right, and you have to keep your turbine behind the line. You cannot reach forward and say, "Woo, my wind is working good. I bring a lot of high energy. I'm super energetic I, because I'm very passionate about what I do. And when I come to the classroom and I'm excited about the day and what we're going to be learning, and I just radiate that energy, the students pick up on that. And they get excited about what we're going to be learning that day as well. Ooh, what did you do with this one? Can you explain what you did here? Um, we stuck the skewers in the room so we didn't have to use too many. Oh, yeah. that is so clever. So instead of getting four skewers and using more materials, you just use them, just use two and suck them through. Very clever. So we're both having this awesome <laughs> high energy relationship and the kids just really buy into what we're learning and what we're studying or what we're building or what we're testing for the day. And it's just really exciting to see what the kids are going to say, what they're going to learn, if they're going to have an aha moment, and just to see their excitement and love for science specifically as we're doing hands-on labs. That just really gets me going, and I love to see them enjoy learning. Okay, ready? Are you ready? Okay. Oh, here we go. Wow, so we're getting up there. It's going, it's going. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. And Whoa. almost there. And yeah, good job ladies, high five. I love what I do. I love being a teacher. I love that I get to bring science and how it works to these middle school kids because I think that's where you have to hook them. And I think it's great to see the kids light up and make connections with the real world and the science world and say, oh, this is why I'm learning this or this is why the math connects of the programming behind the robotics or converting energy from wind to mechanical. And to see them realize, oh, that's what's really happening. And then they go home and share with their parents or they see it outside of school and say, oh, I know why that's happening. That's what I really want for my kiddos. And I just love to see the light bulbs go off and I love to see them have a love for learning in the classroom and I hope they carry that with them throughout their academic career. Come on buddy, just a little bit more, a few more centimeters, woo, nice job, well done, good job. How many was that? Five. Nice job gentlemen.